And I'm oh, ready to start. I'm ready to start if you are. Yep. Let's get it on. Okay. Um, have you looked at I wish it would randomly stuff. select who was feeling. Did you know you have a fat club? Have you um, looked at it, Jim? There's a petition. We can do some of these the like, uh, I hope you do, like some of these pre-made stadiums, so it's neutral field. Cool. Do the uh, pre-made ones have any effects on them or no? Um, I'm not sure. I haven't really played too many friendlies, and when I have, it's mainly just been on, uh, we usually play at my friend's stadium, just because his is like a level zero. Um, yeah. I've been trying to teach him to play some. Um, you know, he doesn't have a whole lot of time to play, but I get in a few friendlies with him every now and then. Hopefully going to get him in the leagues for season three. Yeah. So. No, it's it's one of those things where playing online, it it can be kind of tough, especially right. if uh, if you get bad matchups. Where I had uh, I had a few like really bad online experiences to start with, just because people were, you know, I, I would get matched up with people that were, you know, 500 higher than me. Oh yeah. And you, just, you, you walk in with a with, with a stock team and. It, you I'll just you get what, rolled and pummeled. You have no skill or, or anything. They're like, I'm down two, three, and right. Uh, yeah, that's kind of the problem I had. I was in that very top league, um, the one that's just like a ladder or whatever, uh, with a mm. team. And you know, like you said, sometimes you'll get matched up. I got matched up with a team who was like two, almost two thousand in team value, and I was like nine eighty out of the gate. What's the best against yeah, the running beast? Man. It, it, it can be very oh, tough faster. when you end up getting into situations like that. And I mean, there's not much you can do. You just get you got to put the time in, and it makes it really hard to do that when you're basically every time you come up against somebody, you're. You're under the gun already. If, if you lose one player, you you got nothing that you can do. Right. So, yeah, it's, it's one of those where it's, it's nice to be in a in a league where everybody's kind of starting off pretty close, and you don't end up having that really lopsided matchup. Yeah, because uh, well, that's the thing too. I'm gonna be worried about in this season as well, um, at, or in this league, the MML with us. You know, when we're on to like season three and four, and we have these new coaches coming in at like flat value, I'm worried that it's going to slightly discourage some people from joining, just because they'll have to start off at at a fresh slate. Wow, and it it, it may be to the point where, like season four, right? People pe people will have to know that going into that season, we're gonna have maybe we have a cap at that point going into the like, like at the end of three so that we know okay you're probably going to have to play with either a couple players where you, you you had to get rid of a guy that you like and bring in a new one to lower your team value that's true uh we did have a cap this year i don't think anybody mm -hmm. went over i think they hit uh, some people came super close to hitting it but i don't think anybody went over it But, yeah, no, there was, from what I saw, there was one team that was at the cap. Right. Um, I can't remember which one it was, and there was a handful of them that were under by, you know, 50 or 60. Right. But for the most part, most of the teams were kind of right in that, that, that spot where you want them to be. You know, there's, there's a little bit of an advantage, and you get a little bit of, a, a little bit of help being a returning team, but it wasn't overwhelming. Right. Which, like, like for me, like I said, if I can, if I can end up getting an, an even match in the first two, three weeks, by that point, the difference isn't going to be nearly as big because you'll have one or two players that may have leveled up, or you can play to their strength. Touchdowns are oh, coming. Yeah. The and the nice thing about being chaos as well is how easy it is to get into mutations. Oh, uh, it's it's nice. Um, there's a handful of them that I like. I like extra hands. Um. I actually, uh, I actually had, uh, you must have kick on your guys. Uh, I have kick on my lineman, but I lined him up in the wide zone and shot it with the, <laughs> I shot it with the, the QB 
I wasn't paying this attention. Ball is a dangerous ball. But yeah, it's it's one of those where where you know start, starting off is not a not a big deal being a bit behind. And if you if you can get you know one two games under your belt, you know with with, with a with a young team, you know next thing you know you're you're right there with everybody else. Right. Alone but yeah, chaos. I, I, I like the. Uh, I like extra arm, and I actually made the mistake since I um. Since I wasn't doing a lot of dodging, I ended right. up uh, taking agility once on one of my guys. I'm like, if I <laughs> if I don't end up getting the dodge, then it doesn't really, yeah. it doesn't really do much for me. So it's one of those where you know. You kind of got to end up getting used to some of your players and what they're capable of doing. And... That message from see how this goes. Well, that message from Preach said that uh, that East just went live, so you'll be able to see your schedule after this. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm looking forward to getting in and doing a little bit of playing. That uh, watching the. Uh, Watching that one game really uh, got the juices flowing. And it's just getting in and getting after it. Now. Oh yeah. Kinetic energy. Positioning haircuts, but I've done worse. Uh, that's still gonna be rough. Well, I'm trying to make it difficult for you to shoot right through one of these gaps. I've got, like I said, I've got one or two spots that I don't really like how I'm set up, but I'm all right with it how it is right now. Like I said, I've done I've done a lot worse. There's a lot of dodges there. Yeah, like, I, like I said, it's I've done worse. It, it's it's not bad so far. Um, I got a lot of contact with the players, which is what I wanted to do to start. Um, if I can get my guys up far enough, and if I can get a cage around them, then I then, then I'll be set up good. But yeah, for for a first turn, I'm all right with it. Score most of my touchdowns with him. Block, leap, dodge, yeah. Pretty decent ball carrier. Gone into the opponent's tackle zone. Sure He's also my ball hawk at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Pretty good. I mean, getting uh, getting block, block, leap, and dodge. It makes them makes them hard to take down. Leap, you can get them into a situation so you have to avoid. Uh, you can avoid having to dodge into some of the tackle zones that are real heavy. Get them in so you can at least take a swipe at somebody. Not or, uh, can jump like that. Is he able to get dauntless? Uh, yes. I'm not sure what I have to roll to get it, but he is able to. Cause that that would be another good addition to him, cause he'll he'll be coming in. Oh, <laughs> dang it! I was afraid that was gonna happen. Yeah, cause if you can get Dauntless on him, that'll make him even better, because he's gonna be going. He's he's gonna be attacking, you know, short diced most most of the time. So. Yeah. There's still so many dodges there. Have you used a reroll yet? I don't think I have. Oh, man. Great. Three, four, 
Oh, come on. Defense left and right. Fast and impossible to tap. The fans will oh. love it. Note to self. Get tackle. <laughs> All right. Yeah, there, there are, there are a few uh, Skaven players and Lizardmen players, so definitely tackle would help. Um, well. Yeah, I gotta go through and kind of look at the divisions a bit and see what's what, but it's to the point where I'll probably have to make adjustments according to kind of what we have in my division. Right. Um, oh, good blitz. Seriously. Yeah, it's gonna be one of them games. Keep pushing. <laughs> Did you see the puzzle? You sometimes miss oh, no. the oh, Come on. You're desperately to say something being hit. Oh, he's got it. Beautiful pass. Now the catch. That's a complete. Oh, good catch. Yeah, I still got a long way to go, but I'll try and make something of it. Problem is that even if I get in front of you or past you, you got the speed to be able to come back and get a hold of my guy. You dodge all over the place. Yeah. Oh well. We'll get the ball deep and then play it out, I guess. It's a good way to play it. Well, you got a, you got a few guys upfield on me, so like your thrower could get a hold of it. You could move it up for a touchdown pretty quick, but at this point, yeah. I kind of gotta gotta take oh, what he's given me. Solid punch to the mangy critter. I'll and stop then, it. Uh, Hope to uh, oh. well, at least you didn't have a free run, so you got one free runner and a bunch of guys died, and so I think my beast man's about to get absolutely creamed. These Gavens are just too fast. Look at them. Agility. Yeah, unfortunately. Well, he just takes up space for the most part, I imagine. Yeah, he's usually right in the center of the line of scrimmage. Can play a force possession away from the ball. Big guys pound on him, keep him distracted. Yeah, if it was one of your other players, I'd, I'd think that you'd probably look into a uh, swap him out, but just a lineman just. Let him stay in there if he gets hurt worse, you know. Like, if you lost the strength uh, as a lineman, it'd be worse than losing that agility. Because I don't think he's going to end up doing a lot of ball handling. Uh, most definitely not. Oh, man. I was just gonna say he was in scoring position where he was at. That speed I how mobile will be difficult guys, to man. catch. Tail, Jim. All you need is the tail. Yeah. 
so many scary blocks. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take these one die blocks now. That'll do. I love the sound of the yeah, Skaven I kinda, in pain. Kinda hoping you'd really that sounds like victory. You guys are way more dangerous throwing and running with, the uh, with re rolls than they are without them. So. Yeah, I, I tend to save my re rolls more for passes and like pickups and ball handling than I do punches, just because I know that rats aren't very good at, at punching anybody. So sometimes it's just senseless to waste it on uh, on hits. Only a push. Yeah, I'll take it though. I'm sitting here with uh, with uh, no uh, no block, so there's uh, there's a lot worse things that can happen. Good call. Civilization is the key. It was one of my strengths when I was. We'll take playing. the double. Yeah. The Chaos one, Warriors the one, That's it. Back and then the one thing I hate is not having block. Yeah, Chaos they're, Warriors. They're... Sorry, man. Um, yeah. I was... well, it's, a, it's a disadvantage to start with, yeah. but you can get block on your first level, so you just you start slower. Um, but the nice thing is, is that I don't generally ball handle with a Chaos Warrior, but if you have to, you can you can get get away with it sometimes. So, right. So many things could go wrong. Like that. Yay. Now he gets punched on the go for it. Is the assist gonna be enough to come out on top? <laughs> no, that's my luck. I've had that happen so many times. Heck, for the first for the first two weeks, I'd get punched and I'd be pissed because I didn't realize that when you do the attack at the end that it was a uh, that it was a go for it. <laughs> right. I'm like, I got right there. What the heck? Okay. Yeah, good injury. Now I gotta play one short, so we'll see how that goes. I'll use my reroll. Okay. So Dang it. Impressive. I bet the opposition didn't even see the rerolls though, so no reason scared. not to step forward. On oh nice. Okay. When it smells like old cheese, I let it rip. Oh, he's in range. Oh come on. Nicely done. Oh man, the stadium is huge. <laughs> Let's see what I can do. I gotta go one short now to the injury. Hopefully your KO guy will stand up. There we go. Uh yeah, he he was up earlier, I think, for some reason. But my injured guy's uh, out, so like I said, we'll, we'll, we'll do one like for, uh, for the rest of the game. Gotta make sure I get my one kicker in his proper Not position. Oh, you don't need him in the proper position. The game. Man. It'll be fine. <laughs> Despite being in the lead, this team now has to kick the ball oh. to the losing squad. They'll want to get it back as soon as they can. Alrighty.
Yeah, that's another thing I gotta I, I gotta watch and see how many people in my uh, in the uh, east are gonna end up having guys that have kicked. Keep an eye on that because that'll change kind of how you play people a little bit too. Yeah, the the only reason he has kick is because he's gotten like two MVPs in a pass, I think. So <laughs> I was just like, why are the linemen getting MVP? Okay, so he kicked it instead of the kicker. That's weird. Do they is the MVP set up on a random roll or how yeah, is that set up? Yeah, it's just it's random. It's just completely okay. random. Yeah. I was gonna say, I, I was trying to figure that out. Every now and then it makes sense and then every other time it's like, well that guy really didn't do anything. <laughs> Yeah, and and the sucky part about it is you can have a player die, and then the dead player can still get uh, MVP. Don't tell. I got a connection interrupted little thing in the bottom left there. Yeah, I've got that also. It usually happens about once a game. Yeah. Oh, come on. Give me a better roll this time. <laughs> yeah, at least he picked it up. Yeah. For remaining upright. Pride comes before a fall. Carry it out there for you. and personal Bob. Need to be close. So close they can smell your breath and see the Sorry to interrupt you. That's a dangerous place to be. And we got a free run. Only a stun. I'm alright with that. I can't, I can't afford any more injuries. <laughs> Well, oh, that's one. Yeah. I have. 
I had the blitz open. Um. Hmm. I think he's okay where he's at. <laughs> oh, I gotta squeeze. One more step. I already used my reroll. Yeah. I figured that was coming. The as carrier well. himself blocks. That's really that. risky. I thought about the next thing I get on him being a strip ball. That bad work. Um, Mainly just because he's got leap. Like like I said, Dauntless I think might be the, what I would end up going with. And what does Dauntless do again? Um, when you uh, when you go to block. This formation it, gives uh, them a safe progression. It There's some kind of um I can't remember if it's the uh the difference between your your strength and their strength and then you gotta oh, roll yeah, that's right. and seven. Something like that. The um the uh troll slayers start off with it. Okay. And uh er, I thought it was cool slayers. But yeah, there, there's one of the uh, there's one of the dwarves that actually starts off with it. And I've ha I've had because of that, I've had yeah. those guys come and take out some of my uh, my big guys every now and then and just like it makes no sense how the, how they can end up getting a one or a two block on somebody twice their size. But, yeah. You know, Get in their face! Yeah. You got yourself into this position, so you can get yourself out. He didn't see the opponents around him, did he? <laughs> <laughs> ah, well. Oh, well. Nice. Nuffles kiss. Well, nice for me, but... Yeah, I'm getting beaten up by a bunch of rats. Should have seen it coming. seen a rat run so fast since I fired your agent. <laughs> it's a triple red pie. Interesting. Yeah, sounds good to me. Those vermin are fast. Just because this is a friendly, I'm going to try the silliness here. Oh, I don't think I can leap into a blitz. Blitz. 
an elite. Nope, really? it's, it's one or the other. But it doesn't hurt. Yeah, because... Oh, man. What if you... No, 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 no. Put, put, put Blitz on and then try and activate your leak. Alright. Because you should be able to do both. We'll try it here. Now, as soon as I do Blitz, it deactivates my leak. Really? Because well, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be able to do both. Oh, okay. Yeah, it does work. Neat. That works. Really? No, no, you want to re-roll that. Trust me, you don't want that. No. Yeah, one of them is a push. Uh, you had a push. Yeah, but I, I wanted to keep it in between all four of my guys, hoping that one of them would end up grabbing the ball. Ah, uh, okay. That's true. Alright, now let's try this silliness. Alright, one more. Oh. Okay, we'll reroll the pickup. Alright, one more. Yay. Oh, come on! You're kidding me! Oh. That's what I get. I, sh I should have went with the push. <laughs> ah! I knew it. I knew as soon as I stepped him that second time, he was going to fumble it. I don't think you have anybody reliably in range. One person. Well, I can get them all over there. But... I, I, I've got to dodge through your zone for it, though. Yeah. Try one more. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That works. Well, it's actually not what I was hoping for. That player is so close to a world. I'm hoping to get just a, uh, just a regular push and then crowd surf you with a blitz. Yeah. But. I guess I can't can't complain too much. I already used my reroll, so I might as well do something stupid. I'm gonna get a punch in the face. Oh, we didn't get there. <laughs> that player better get up. Nothing sometimes. good comes from spending any time on the ground in this game. Yeah, being a friendly, it's a lot less stressful. You know? Yeah, I don't mind as much if my players die because I know they're just coming back. <laughs> one of those where it's, it's nice you can try a different positioning like if if it wasn't a friendly I probably wouldn't have did that get up and run and try and do the blitz I probably would have just came up a couple of squares and you know stood in position hoping that I could survive to the next turn to put the ball back then just go and do all my double double dice blocks up top so Ooh. Somebody's having a bad day today. And that man's Jack Daniels. Where does it go? That's actually a good Nice catch. Now go on, buddy. Touchdown. Oh. It's a rough first half. It is a little bit of an unfair match, mainly because they didn't let you get your inducement since it was a friendly. Yeah, it'd be all right. All I'd end up probably getting would be the wizard. Yeah, that's what I was gonna. One of your guys. That's what I was gonna I'd say. I'd lightning bolt one of your guys when they were deep in your zone. Yep. The there, the away. lightning bolt is just but amazing for that. That's crazy. As his team has just kicked it away. <laughs> I hate one thing about the lightning bolt. What's that? I have the worst. I have the worst luck with it. Yeah. It, it's it's eighty three percent for everyone else. I think it's about fifty fifty for me. <laughs> it, it, it is amazing how many times I'm like, oh yeah, this is perfect. I end my turn, drop the lightning bolt on them. I've got almost everybody else down. You know, I got everybody around the area stunned. I'm, it's set up perfect. Lightning bolt, nothing happens. <laughs> that worked great last time. Let's try that again. <laughs> I 
Do you remember to move your kick guy over? I did, but my quarterback is still the one kicking it. Maybe it's just because he has accurate. Maybe he has accurate. Ooh. Oh, man, that should be. The, the rock is the worst. Like, I hate that. Yes. That one should not even be a thing. <laughs> um, maybe try doing this. Next kick, take and um, swap them. And then yeah. do a do a save for your uh, formation. Okay. Because I've I've had sometimes where if you save it as a formation, it kind of right. I don't know if it does like a refresh on it or something. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's have some fun. For the most part, though, it's uh, it's been going exactly where I wanted to put it. So I feel like accurate applies to his kicks as well, since he's the one throwing it with his arm. I may yeah. be wrong on I that mean, though. It, 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 it could. I don't know. I've never heard of it that way. Right. But, um... He's only a lineman, and this is a friendly, so I'm not even mad. <laughs> yeah. Dead. 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 That's, honestly, right now, that's my biggest fear. Game one. I, I, it, all my guys will basically have nothing, but losing a player first, first game is what worries me. Oh, yeah. That's the type of thing that keeps me awake at night. <laughs> Most definitely. Hey, at least Just, you probably will not lose three to four players in one game. Oh, I, that was painful to watch. I Every time one went out, I was just wincing and making just that noise like they were mine. Cause it yeah. Just, once the tables get turned like that, if you're not the one on the, uh, on the side where where you've got the advantage, you everyone's had that game where it just everything goes wrong and you're just trying to get through it. Oh yeah, most definitely. I mean, I've I've played that against the computer every now and then. I'd, I'd have like a like an like an orc team or something like that, and I'm I'm sitting there going, I'm gonna go in there and I'm just gonna destroy them. And then the first drive, you're down two, three players, and you're like, what what are these elves doing to me? You know, it's just you, you get one two bad blocks, and all oh, of a yeah. sudden you know that you're gonna have a long day. Most definitely. Mark my words, Jim. This guy's got legs that would put what's a, a What's a base level line that costs for a skating team? He's like five yeah, grand, maybe? No, I think it's more than that. I think it's like seven. Oh, they can't be that much for, for your basic lineman? I may be wrong. With anything. That's true. Uh, it may be around five grand. Five I could see. I was thinking if they if they started off at four, keeping one two extras as soon as as soon as soon as you get into the situation like I'm in, right, where 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 you you, you got a numbers advantage on somebody, you could start surrounding them and doing a foul with the lineman if you got them, and creating all kinds of headaches. Because, like, my beast men, I think, are six. And following with hit with a beast man just... It, it The numbers just don't add up. Right. I, I've thought about doing it once I got... Once I got a team up to the point where I had 12, 13 guys, maybe have right one guy, where if they had a player that I really needed Come to get rid of, together. doing right. that and just having one guy with dirty player... And uh, and doing it that way, but it just it just seems like such a waste to have to have a player that's just for that purpose, right? And then I mean I'm looking at what 
80. Six, 60 for the uh, the player, and then for one level, and then he, he wouldn't even have block. <laughs> right. One thing I thought in yeah. that's interesting about the Bretonians is how their linemen start off with a. Uh, they start off with wrestling. That's always been they, they start off. I actually thought about. Um, I actually thought about using them after looking at the league a little bit. Mm -hmm. I think somebody finally Loosen picked them. The but yes. up until up until I mean, today, I thought the league didn't have anybody with them. Right. Oh man. Which it, I I I, th I thought maybe if you know just getting. Getting get, getting Let's one of those ball. teams in there could Good be move. an issue for other people because they're never going to see it. Right. Yeah, I I almost went Bretonian, but I played with them a little bit, and they just do not fit my playstyle. Like, oh. Oh yeah. Uh, I waited a little too late to pick up the lizard men because they fit my playstyle like what I look to achieve perfectly. Um, the Skaven kind of yeah. do because of their explosive offense, but there's just no punching with them pretty much against anybody unless you stack up. Oh yeah, I. I ended up going chaos, and then I, I instantly had that moment where I'm like, I should have went lizard then. <laughs> chaos I is nice I, I, the key. Was one of my strengths when I was they're there. slow. It, they're, they're just they're slow to get where I want to go with them. Mm -hmm. But I mean, once once I get guys up to level two, three, I'm fine. But it's it's the first. It's gonna always be those first five, six, seven games. Like this first season, for me, it's just survive and and level guys up and try not get frustrated. Because there's gonna be games where I am just completely out of it. I know. So yeah, that, that, that it, it, first, first season sportsmanship, ma making sure to get through it, and then yeah. you know once I can get my guys kind of situate a little bit and figure out kind of where I'm at with the league you know and uh, get 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 a get get a feeling for kind of how other people are playing in that and, uh, to be well and then the nice thing about uh, chaos is that you can really make adjustments to your team right um, because they have the, the beastmen have your your general stats your strength and your mutation available you can really cater to who you're playing with. yeah and, and that's what i was going to say as well they're so versatile like you said that you just pretty much whatever league you're in you just develop them around it which ultimately that's what you should do with every team but you know some teams have trouble doing that depending on who they are I thought about just for fun taking and uh, do, doing uh, all my guys up just to I frustrate uh, in their elf dreams <laughs> and set them all up with tackle and tail so you can't dodge them. That would be amazing. Uh, just because we do have a lot of elves, I think we're mainly saturated with orcs. I think that's what we have the most of. To the winning team again. Um, I'm pretty sure it is. I remember looking at them and thinking, if if you break if you break the uh, the different teams into like teams with dodge and stunty, right? You know, like I don't know what you'd end up calling the lizardmen because they can kind of do both. Mm -hmm. But if you put them because they can go heavy, go put put them into bash. I think our mix is a little bit heavy on bash, but it's almost like 60-40. Right. So it, it's to, it's to the point where yeah you, you do have some really heavy bash teams out there, and each each um each division seems to be spread pretty good too. I know on in the east we've got um, two human teams, so if you look at them, it's just gonna be in general. Um, but yeah, we, we've got a lot of we got a lot of I think in the in the west you guys are heavy on orcs, and I know in the east we've got um two dwarf teams that are that are gonna be an absolute nightmare. Well because they uh, pretty much start with almost everybody with block. 
Yeah, well that too, and Frozen Thrones, I'm not sure what side they're in, but they won last year. They were 3-0. and um, Yeah, he, he, he's he's on our side. I uh, I was looking at that, and I was just crossing my fingers that I don't get him first week, because I've, I've played well, Early Chaos versus um, Experienced Dwarves, and it does not do end well. Anything. Yeah, uh, we'll, we'll be able to to view your uh, your schedule after this though, so get to see oh, who yeah. you're who you're preparing for. Fuck. I was thinking about setting up one of my uh, beastmen, right? Taking uh, ex take an extra arm for the first one, and then uh, kick return for second. Right. And if I do that, it'll work good as long as people don't have kick. But if people have kick, it really makes it tough to uh, to, to get the uh, to, to get the guy in position, so you don't have to pick pick the ball up. Oh, this this isn't gonna end well. <laughs> I think you need one more guy for that uh, chaos warrior on the far right. Yeah, I think it'll be your left. Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. I've got, I've got, I've moved everybody now. Damn. Damn. Caught the ball. Yay. That there are all Skaven leagues played in great but that being said, if you get one, uh, the teams are if you get one guy down, you can start repositioning so the rest of them. Clan Skyr teams, Clan Eshin teams, uh, and so on. Uh, you lost me after Bob. Jim. Don't talk to me for the next few downs. Yeah, and I was, I was debating instead of putting a stagger, stack them yeah, up two in a row. Like a good old yeah. Fight. Um, but I figured if I staggered, it'd make it a little bit more difficult because you'd have to go through more dodge zones if you wanted to try and get all the way through. Oh yeah, that's uh, definitely is the case. Uh, make you try and bash it out with the heavies instead of running it through clean. Apparently, that's his best route. It's the same either way. No, it's not. Okay. No, the other way you only got one dodge because you, you slip yeah. halfway into his, his zone. That's true. Let's just do this first. I'm gonna just try some silliness. Yeah, that's what friendlies are for. You get to experiment. Good call. Accurate work. Try, try a few different things. That's pretty unlucky. Yeah, I definitely did not want to. Oh, it was oh, double bad. Okay. <laughs> that being said. It doesn't really give me a whole lot of options to do this. So. Oh, well. That works. Yeah. I figured if I, uh, if I missed on him and only got a push, I could kick him over that other way. Uh, other guy on the, uh, the other side really? and get another swipe at him without using a blitz. What sucks is uh, I usually have two blitzers, but last game of the season, I uh, got an injury to one, and he has to miss his next game. So game one of season two, I'm only going to have one blitzer. So. Yeah. It, uh, it definitely could have been worse, though. Oh yeah, he could have died. <laughs> Cause well, d died or had one of those where you lose movement. Yeah, that's or true. Or agility. Too. Movement and agility can be huge in your team. Where you know, what, like me, if I got a guy one movement down, and I just park him near the line or somewhere where he's not that big of a, it's not that big of a deal. But yeah, you get uh, you get scathing that lose movement, and that's. They have such such a movement advantage against teams. I mean, I'd I'd like to see like Skaven versus Dwarves, and just to really show off that mobility. 
Oh, it's so fun to play dwarves just because you just have to put three people on the line and then you just run and pass all over them. Um, I've only played dwarf twice with Skaven and both times it was like a really big lead. Uh, well, one of the tricks too is if they go death roller, you just try to get the ball first and then score really quick and get that death roller off. Oh, and yeah. Then, and then, you know, they're already gimped from there. Yeah, and they're pissed off at the death roll, you know, their, their, their little toy got taken away. <laughs> and that's, uh, over in the, uh, over in the east, we actually have a death roller, so. Yeah. Oh, that's fun. He probably went with the pre-built, or he wanted to go with death roller, one of the two. No, I, best I can tell, I think he added death roller as his 12th. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, so he built into it. Yeah, he, he he started off without it and then ended up going. Ah, uh, there's death nothing wrong. After. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with building into it. It's just starting out the thrower that's kind of iffy. Well, yeah, you, oh, you oh, you've oh. got to be prepared to you got to be prepared to go, you know, ten and eleven after your first half. But no. It, Death Roller's not bad, but the problem is you got all that team value value locked up in, in a guy that you can only use for a half. Yeah. And that's it. that's if you if you play it perfectly. Well, that's like you and know I, some some teams you play against can score on turn one depending on how they build their team. Oh yeah, which is absolutely frightening. Oh yeah, it's not fun to play against. Um, it's kind of easy with the Skaven, but you do have to roll doubles to get your extra movement. Um, yeah, but it's it, it's it's a cleaner way to do it with Skaven. If if you look up the only way to get the Chaos to do it, you have to rely on the other team setting up a certain way. Right. That you that you have to chain push your uh, your ball carrier halfway up the pitch before you can even have the possibility. Yeah, I don't think those numbers are going to get any better. I thought they would, but they definitely didn't. Well, I got three tackle zones on that ball. I got a four pack of beast then. Moment of truth. It looks okay. like it's going to be an over the top jump. Oh, he's Not agility four, yeah. Like he's uh he's all set up for leaping. He's got a dodge. Ugh. He's got red dodge. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a friendly suggestion. Yeah. Get your gunner up get your gutter runner off that sideline. That's true as well. That's it. I got in the habit of if I'm picking a guy up, pick him up. If I'm going to move him, move him, and do all that before I do my uh, my blocks and that. I still mess up with it, but if I can just keep doing that, I play a lot better because I'm not I'm not forgetting to pick a guy off the ground, or I'm not getting caught to the point where. Unless I have plans where I want to get them up and move them, where I'm cleaning the guy out, you know, picking them up is is a free action. Oh, okay. This next game, I'll just use that one. Right? Yeah. Uh, I fractured leg or dead. Um, I will go with the fractured leg. <laughs> uh, it's the same thing either way and friendly, but still. It's yeah. Possible. Well, that's I. <laughs> When I need that, it always goes bad to worse. Oh yeah, same yeah. here. Uh, it's sometimes I would just rather not have it <laughs> for yeah. that reason. My favorite is when he's dead and then you roll it and then he's still dead. Yeah, just reminding you <laughs> that he's really, really dead. He's not mostly <laughs> dead, he's all the way dead. He is that special level of dead that you never get to come back from. The magic sponge yeah. did not work. <laughs> That's 
Watch it. Force them back and then pow. The attacker has an assist. Ah. Oh. Call it a turn. <laughs> and that is why I miss block so much. Oh yeah. Yeah, I played against the computer a bunch with uh with chaos trying to get a feel for kind of how how guys developed and to what level of usefulness they were and yeah it's it's pretty hit and miss you know i i think with my team i'm gonna probably have to diversify it enough to, for the ball, but to have a few guys that can do a little bit of everything and then just try and play to their strengths depending on who i'm playing against as, as much fun as it would be to just show up and be a nightmare for all the elf teams and that, I would get absolutely slaughtered by all the, uh, by all the, uh, dwarf teams and lizard men and stuff like that. We're gonna try this. I really don't have any Oh, here comes the pass. Here comes the pass. This one's a medium pass with a reroll. Let's wow, try it. You get an interception oh. here. You gotta roll a six. Oh, that was a sick pass. He's got accurate, so that really helps there. I, I have to admit, it's fun watching pass plays like that. Because, because in my head, I know how risky they are. Yeah, and, and that's why I went with Skaven over Lizardman in this league, just because I wanted to pass through the orcs. Because I saw we were so orc heavy that I figured if I could get a passing game down, I could just blow through them. Um, but try, uh, tr tr try to save with the kicker in the middle and see if that works. All right. The docks are doing their job. They've kicked the ball to the opponents. Now it's time to think defensively. Okay, let's see. Why not do this? work? Mm, nope, still going to the uh, to the uh, QB. Maybe the game knows something we don't. <laughs> yeah, probably. It just seems weird because uh, I know a lot of teams will have the, uh, the kicker be in the, uh, in the front row. What was that? your favorite moment as a blood I don't know. have to read up on oh, it a little bit, well. I guess. It has to be scoring my first touchdown, Jim. Oh, you see, I just ripped Man, the head off this a kid, day today. giving me some lip <laughs> in the changing rooms before the game. So just for fun, I shot the ball down his throat and then lobbed his whole body into the end zone. Yeah, oh, it's still going to be a dodge a catch, anywhere I go. So I scored a touchdown. It'll be less dodge. Hang on, did you it's just that? fun to leap. You got to admit it. Oh, most definitely. Oh. Yeah, that was. He's just gonna get the the tar hit out of him when 
Well, yeah, my, my, my beastmen aren't aren't fond of people doing that, you know. Bill Ramanowski really does not like that. <laughs> A push will do. With Chris Slaylin, he's following up, hoping to get the knockdown next time. I blitz with my QBE far more than I probably should. Eh, there's nothing wrong with it. Um, you kind of, with Skate, and you kind of got to do that a little bit because he's got three strength and you have a few players that are two. So it kind of puts you in a position where to, to get that one extra block, you, you kind of got to make that, that move every now and then. Right. Get next to the ball carrier so you can block it. And if that doesn't work, damn, that one was face. a pal. I thought Wait, that one was that? also a stumble. Wait, what? What? KO. Dodge that. Whisker, get. Look out. Time to have some fun. Pick that dang thing up. Don't like this, but. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I, I hate I to say it, but it's it's fu it's fun watching them fail sometimes. Oh yeah, it's funny though because the way they do it, like the the beastmen, they look like they're wrestling, like professional wrestlers. It looks like they just took oh, a yeah. punch. They just sell oh. it so well. Oh, two deaths. That's interesting. Sound of the in pain. Sounds like victory. I thought we might have one of those horrible games without at least one. Yeah, if I could have had that kind of luck uh, earlier in the game, it might have been a little bit more interesting. But... Well, I got. I got to say, you, you do a good job of. Getting your uh, your rats in position to score as soon as you get the ball, though. Yeah, uh, well, that, like you, like we were mentioning earlier, that's pretty much like the main objective of rats is to get dudes always with the ability, like in a position to score if you can. Uh, mainly because you know they're not really good at anything but offense. Um, their defense is a little shoddy because they're just so weak. Oh, that's not who I wanted to get that, but okay. I guess that'll do. Because that's what I mean. The one nice thing about Chaos is that the Beastmen have horns, so if you blitz with them, they turn into a four. Yeah, the that, horns that is, is the one. That horns. is the one nice thing about them. Horns is really <laughs> nice. Oh god, worst time for a controller to die. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna have to swap real quick. Yeah, that's all right. Got enough of time. Only 40 seconds. You're in good position. I can get a blitz on your guy, but other than that, you got a, a few blocks to do. Nothing, nothing major. Got a few dice there. This player likes to be well assisted in fight. That was helpful. All right, make the dodge. Yay! Uh, I wanted to push on that corner. Oh, 
Oh, that's now a good spot. Still a good lift, though. Oh. Well, if I would have did it the opposite way, I could have forced him off to the left. And I've got more guys over there, but... It's a solid yeah. Kill the fool, Harry He's only stunned. Yeah, I should still this guy up and be possible all that, though. Oh man, that's going to be like no man's <laughs> land. Mainly because my leaper is out. I would just leap on the ball if I could. Yeah. Might well, as well stay although leaping, up, leaping on the ball in that situation might not be good either because... That's true. It's, it's, it's going to be a... What is it? What's the one above... 37% pickup, something like that? Yeah, I think so. 33. 33% pickup, I mean. Although he had sure hands, didn't he? Uh, no. He didn't. The no, quarterback has sure hands. Like oh, silliness. Head, Why not? Use a reroll. I got one for free. Yay. Mm, still bad. Yeah, I gotta admit, where you guys are standing, I think this is gonna hurt. Unity is strength. Well, that's fun. Fragile, very fragile. I should have put him on the ball. Should have put it in your dude's hand. Uh, yeah, I'm feeling the pain. <laughs> there, all, just, all fall down. Okay, I'm yep. okay with that. Should have known. That's one reason they have block. That guy will be the I gotta get him sure feet so I can choose where he goes. Yeah. I think I may end up giving him leap too. I think I'm gonna give both of my blodgers leap. How many times am I gonna push this guy? Why don't you just fall over? Only one way to go. <laughs> now you can play the ball. <laughs> really? Fine. Uh, Stand on that ball again. See what happens next. 
Boom. Oh, nice. Almost. I really don't want to dodge out of there. Oh, I see. He's got two dodges. This is not going to go well. Oh, nice. Nice out. Oh, he's got a pass. That's a good economical pass. I can't catch him. That's a TD. Oh my god. There's no way I can catch him. <laughs> I got maybe one guy, maybe two. You got you got a guy on the edge that can probably dodge out and get, catch up to him. Yeah, you got You got a lineman that's got uh a uh, go he's got a dodge and then a go for it. Oh. Oh, I should have went with him. That's who it should have went, because he's got well, blocked. Well, Steven moves like a brown streak. <laughs> well, that's one way to describe it. This is a two-piece here. It's a two-piece operation. Oh, no. Use the Z roll. Well, your other one only had a strength of two also. That's true. Although, it would have helped in that situation. Oh, nice. Oh, Ram, Ram Chancellor. <laughs> Is that two that I've made miss next to, made miss the next game? Yep, that's two. Uh, I believe so. Oh man, he's just gonna get the crap blitzed out of him now, though. <laughs> it, 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 it's time to just take out the frustrations on the rats that are left behind. <laughs> Go ahead, man. It's a friendly. Kill them all if you have to. Oh no, we're, we're just taking the easy blocks and then we're gonna go, to take, go take care of this Solid dirty rat out here. Critter will stop it flipping around. <laughs> that player's shuffling off the field. <laughs> that was the Watch only the one block that you had to make. I should have stood up more people. Eh, nah, we can get away with it in friendlies. Alright, Steven Gokowski. Oh, yay! Really? Really? He had one job. <laughs> That's quite a he can still take the ball out there. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, as well. Oh, <laughs> oh no! He died! <laughs> This game is just pure silliness. That is, when somebody asks me what Blood Bowl is, I tell them sadness and silliness. Because... Well, it's you, got a little bit of both in this one. Yeah, because you never know what's going to happen. Oh, that was brilliant. Does all the difficult things. Pushes the guy out of the way. Even makes the dodge. Then he falls over. It wasn't even asked for granted. Holy cow. That's not happening. I'm not even going to attempt what that, what just showed there. Ugh. He's not making it out of there. What else? That girl's earned their wages today. That dodge is still abysmal. Why not? Neat. <laughs> Small, slippery, and truly annoying. 
What was that? 33, 50, and 67? Yeah, but he does have dodge, and he didn't even have to re-roll but one of them, I think, if any. I just see that, and then I think my guy tripped on his <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, GFI is the worst, especially... I hate it when you trip, and then you re-roll, and then you trip again. It's like, really? I rolled one twice in a row? Twice. In a row. <laughs> I love the fact that that stuff happens because I know the staggering odds that it shouldn't happen. And right. The fact that it still does happen, it just the the math problem in my head. I can do nothing but laugh at. It's looking like a touchdown for you, and there's not much I can do to stop it. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. This is going to be there decisive. Go. Oh. <laughs> okay. That's what they've been done. Oh. Because it's the other team's go. Yeah. with the re-roll. Oh wait, he didn't have a re-roll, did he? He's got a dodge. He's so him. he gets a re-roll. Oh yeah, he, he had a re-roll. Okay. Now that, I did not get to re-roll. No. I should have GFI'd for the handoff. <laughs> nah. Well, either way, it was a good so game. Yeah, good Let's game, go. man. Thanks I've for playing. Count. I mean, um, I can only count to next time I'll, we'll have to play a little bit of a more fair match right? than that. Um, I'm fine with it. It's a, it, it's a good warm up. Yeah. I know that this season there's going to be a handful of games that are going to be kind of a little bit behind the eight ball to start with. So it's good to have a, a little bit of a, a little bit of a pregame that kind of gets you used to it. You know, playing a little bit behind. Oh yeah. You know, not giving up, trying to make something happen. I thought for a second there was actually going to get a touchdown. <laughs> yeah, and and then too, like you said, a lot of your people will be on the same page as you, um, so it's, uh, it's yeah. going to help. Oh, we can actually check out your schedule now. He said it was live, so you can actually... Joining a league gives you loads of new opponents to budget. You too can widen your horizon. We'll look in the east. Oh, good, I'm playing a human team first. Oh, that's gonna be good for you. Let's see. We're playing. Yep. Goliath Gladiators. Or I think I said that wrong. I can't read that very well from here. <laughs> the like... got the got lead gladiators. Eh. Yeah, let's see what they got. Eleven players. Four blitzers, a catcher, catcher, a thrower, four blitzers, and an ogre. Three yes. rolls. Eh. I've seen worse. Yeah, I'll and then have. Then... Except for the ogre, if I can keep the ogre busy with a uh, with a beastman. Yeah. I'll have uh, I'll have dice advantage on five of his players. Nice. Yeah, uh, you definitely need to look into getting your streaming set up. I would uh, more than likely watch your game. Um, I've, I will pretty much watch anybody's game who streams it just to kind of keep up with how the rest of the league is doing. Um, yeah, I've got, um, I set up my uh, my Twitch account that I haven't tried any real streaming. I did like a test stream. Yeah. Um, I've, I've still got a, I've got, I've got to plug in a, a hard, uh, a hard cable for when I'm streaming. Right oh, now, okay. I'm also on tonight's show, Big Jobo yeah, Hairyfoot uh, comes back from the yeah, dead I, I don't to talk know about what, his um, remarkably short what, uh, tenure as captain of the Greenfield or not Grass Hunters. But uh, which uh, definition I'll end up streaming on it with. Uh, I, I stream yeah, mine I, I, and... Oh, my bad, I didn't mean to cut you off there. Oh, no, you're good. 
uh, I stream mine in the uh, the the best HD and really don't have any trouble. Uh, I go through and like rewatch them, and I've never really had any trouble with any lagging or anything. It's even in game. Um, now the live yeah. stream may be a different story. The people watching it may lag a little, but uh, I think it's got a, a setup on there to do a delay anyway. For like a, a little yeah. a few second delay to help with lag for the watchers anyway so um but yeah i've, I've just yeah, got mine that was uh. hey, I, I was watching your game earlier on that and i actually had it on my laptop so i could check out like chat and that kind of stuff to see how stuff worked mm -hmm. and then i had on my uh, on the playstation 4 i had it uh streaming on both of them and you could see that one of them had a different buffer time than the other one a little bit but so right. yeah. yeah tomorrow I'll have to check and see who I'm playing against and then start setting stuff up with them yeah hopefully get it in uh, hopefully get it in sometime this week I don't know what time zone some of these other people are in because I know that uh, being in the east it's yeah it can be pretty big it, difference. It, it, it can be a pretty big time difference but I yeah. know for the, uh, face for the Monday you games, know? if, if did I did, you know you a, have a did one on the Monday, you looked at that it, I would end up um, a petition to basically having to from start the at 3 in the afternoon. So okay. let's see how that goes. Do they um project out uh, like what the uh, second week is? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's got the whole, the whole season uh, up, I believe. You play Chaos uh, week two. Four, he went four warriors, the rest beast man on his build. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what the same, same that yeah. I've got. Yeah. Although I think he went with 12 players, if I remember right. Let's see. Because I, I can't remember if there was there was one guy in our league. Nah, I don't he, know if he's still here. He's 11. Dian okay. Um, I there, there, was a, there was a guy that I saw in, in the league that had maxed out the number of players and didn't take any re-rolls oh wow okay i can't i can't remember what what team it was i i, I couldn't deal was... with that couldn't deal with that <laughs> oh i just I, I i saw it and i, I like i said yeah. i was i was in dis disbelief you said they okay, were in the west so I, I think there were I think there were in my half. Oh, okay. In the okay, east. so week week three I play a returning team. I play the Blood Wings week three, but they're uh, okay. I think the 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 Blood Wings were uh, Dark Elves. So if I can get my block figured out by then, I'll be fine. Oh, and then week four I've got the Green Tide. Talismans are oh, the, the Darby Blood, well, be Blood Wings. Used arcane item. Yeah. Uh, week three I've got them. Um, uh, I think that. You just can't trust I think they're fresh this time. They may have. I think some people did return, and then they played a different team. Is what a couple people did. Um. Okay. Yeah, they they are fresh, but those are dark elves. Okay. So. Yeah the the poor scuttlebutts uh, they had so many deaths last season, um, and they carried over too. Um, With all the deaths. Yes, their their team value is only like 840. I think they're in the west. They're a Skaven team. Yeah, 840. The they they won their first game pretty big. And then from there, they just kept getting smacked around. They're only up to nine players right now. Uh, um, yeah, well, I'm going to uh, cut the stream off here real quick since we got the game finished up. All right. All right.